Did you know David Beckham rejected the number 7 jersey at Real Madrid and wore the number 23 instead? Here are 10 football jersey numbers with deeper meanings. Starting it off with Phil Foden. The star boy of Manchester City wears number 47. After Aguero's departure, Foden was offered the number 10 jersey, but he chose to stick with 47. It turns out there's an emotional side to it. Foden's late grandfather Ronnie passed away at the age of 47 when Phil was still in the Manchester City Academy, and Foden decided to stick with number 47 ever since, out of respect and loving memory of his gramps. Foden has also expressed his desire to carve out his own path in football history and not be defined by the legacy of past players. Mohamed Salah is Liverpool's talisman, but back in the day he played for Fiorentina and wore the number 74 shirt. He paid tribute to the victims of the Port Said Stadium disaster in Egypt. This incident occurred in February 2012 and resulted in the deaths of 74 people after crowd violence erupted during a top-flight game between Al Masri and Al Ali. Choosing to wear the number 74 was a way for Salah to remember and honor those who lost their lives in this tragic event. This gesture was praised by many for its sensitivity and respect. The Port Said disaster is considered the worst in Egyptian football history. The violence was fueled by political tensions and rivalry between the two clubs. While Salah only wore the number for a short time, the gesture cemented his image as a player who is deeply connected to his roots and values. I will make a video on 10 footballers who were rejected as youngsters if this video gets 1,000 likes. David Beckham's story is different. When he joined Real Madrid in 2003, Beckham discovered that his preferred number seven was already taken by club captain and legend Raul. Beckham respected the tradition and hierarchy and never considered asking for the number seven because it would be disrespectful to Raul. Beckham chose the number 23 instead. It's because of his admiration for basketball legend Michael Jordan, who wore the same number for the Chicago Bulls. Beckham and his wife Victoria were big fans of Jordan. Victoria played a role in his decision. During discussions with the club about available numbers, Victoria favored the number 23 and influenced Beckham's final choice. The number 23 became more than just a jersey number. It represented a story of respect, inspiration, and a new beginning. Jude Bellingham is one of the best players in the world. He wore number 22 for Birmingham and Dortmund. The reason he wore the rather unusual squad number is due to his coaches at Birmingham. They told him from a young age that he should not limit himself to one role. Bellingham could play as a number four, which is a holding midfielder, as a number eight, which is a box-to-box -box midfielder, and a number 10, which is an attacking midfielder. He was good at all those positions and played each position at the same level. So the coaches added those digits together and gave him the number 22. It stuck until he joined Madrid. Now he is rocking the number five jersey like his idol Zinedine Zidane. On the other hand, Donny van de Beek went through a different scenario. Van de Beek used to wear a traditional number six at Ajax. But when Donny joined Manchester United, he decided to wear 34. But there's an emotional reason for that. Back in 2017, Ajax youngster Abdelhak Nouri collapsed on the pitch in a preseason friendly. Nouri was just 20 at the time, and he was left with permanent brain damage. Nouri used to wear the number 34 shirt during his playing days. Van de Beek is Nouri's close friend, and that is why he paid tribute by wearing United's number 34 shirt. Um, this is a special thing for me because my good friend, uh, Abdelhak Nouri, I'm really good with his family um, and his brother is one of my best friends and I talk a lot with them and uh, I decide to, to take his uh, old uh, number of the t-shirt and I want to, uh, to get good uh, memories with this number. This tribute stands as a testament that football is more than just a game. When Casemiro joined Manchester United, he chose number 18 shirt. But why? Well, Casemiro has openly said that Paul Scholes, who wore the number 18 for most of his career at Manchester United, was his favorite player at the club. He admired Scholes for his passion, fighting spirit, and incredible long-range passing. Choosing number 18 was a tribute to Scholes and a way for Casemiro to channel his inspiration. Number 18 also carries a significant weight at Manchester United, having been worn by other legends like Brian Robson and Dennis Law. Donning the same number as these icons could be a way for Casemiro to show his respect for the club's history and his ambition to leave his own mark. Mesut Ozil is another legend who chose an unusual number. After having his Arsenal contract terminated, Ozil went to Turkey and joined Fenerbahce, and rather than take the number 10, he chose the left field option of number 67. 
It's believed that the number is a sweet nod to his heritage. The number 67 is the area code of Zonguldak, the Turkish province where his family lived before emigrating to Germany. Ozil's touch of enigma was a silent declaration of the ties that bound him to his origins. A beautiful gesture indeed. Whereas Bruno Guimarães, the Newcastle star, has played for four clubs in his career across the globe, but one thing has remained constant. Guimarães wearing the number 39 shirt, and it turns out there is a reason. His dad. Guimarães' father drove a taxi, and his taxi number was 39. His father supported him through thick and thin in his football journey, and that's why Bruno decided to honor his father by wearing the number 39. It's a constant reminder of his family's sacrifices and a source of inspiration. Similarly, Radamel Falcao has also paid tribute to his father and kept his memory alive. Falcao's choice of number three at Rayo Vallecano was a sentimental homage to his late father, Radamel Enrique Garcia King, while number three is an unusual choice for a striker. The number holds deep meaning for Falcao, as his father had worn it throughout his own playing career. His father passed on his passion for football to Falcao, by choosing number three, Falcao wasn't merely donning a garment. He was embracing a symbol of his father's spirit. It was a way of carrying his father's memory onto the pitch, a silent vow to honor his legacy with every touch, every pass, every goal. Kristen Press has become synonymous with the number 23 shirt with the U.S. women's national team, but she chose the number 24 jersey at Manchester United instead. It was chosen as a nod to basketball legend Kobe Bryant who was tragically killed in a helicopter crash alongside his daughter Gianna and seven other people in 2020. I definitely chose this with a little nod to Kobe because I'm an LA girl um, and grew up and you know everyone everywhere we went they were crazy for Kobe and, and the amount of inspiration and joy that um, he gave people by the way he played with his passion is um, is amazing and you know it's something that as athletes we're all striving to do. Bixente Lizarazu has cult fame for his number 69. Lizarazu apparently had valid reasons for picking the number 69 on the back of his shirt when he returned to Bayern Munich in 2005. Lizarazu was born in 1969 but also stands at 169 centimeters tall and weighed 69 kilos at the time. Maybe the number was lucky as he won the domestic double with the club winning the Bundesliga title and DFB Pokal. There are a few honorable mentions like Danny Alves and Steven Bywater, but we can cover those on some other day. I am sure there are many more footballers with such stories. Let me know in the comments who I missed. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. Also, turn on the bell notification so you never miss out on new content. Catch you in the next one. Bye.